Hey, what's up guys? Grand Hobby coming back to you guys with another break. The first break in a series of breaks that I've been looking forward to now for a good year and a half since I began this kind of project. I've mentioned it a few times on the channel and we are finally going to do this today, uh, at least start the series here today. Um, I started a goal of a series about a year and a half ago where I started acquiring packs of upper deck hockey cards. My initial goal was to try to acquire one hobby pack of every single year and release of the Upper Deck flagship hockey products since the inception of uh, you know 1990, 91 Premier Edition, the low and high series and stuff like that, all the way up through present date. I started this back, like I said, about a year and a half ago. The plan was to do a break with a pack of every year, a hobby pack of every year. Um, nice little series of videos leading up to the release of 20... 21 series one however i was unable to do that um to get all the packs in time because it's really really tough to kind of get every one of these packs some of these are really hard to come by um then i made my goal to do it, to do it in time for 2021 series two uh you know with concluding and doing a hobby box of 2021 series two but again did not have the packs in time tried again for extended did not get it in time for that Finally acquired every single pack with the exception of one single pack, which is uh, 03, 04 Series 1, unfortunately. Just can't get it. I had one chance in the last year to get that pack. Uh, it was in a hobby box. The hobby box, I, I missed out on the bids getting it. Um, just can't find a pack or a hobby box of that anywhere. Um, so, unfortunately, that's the only pack, and I'm just kind of throwing in the towel on that one. But I have every other pack, guys, um, and this will be the only long introduction to this. This is going to be a seven-part series um uh, where i'm breaking up kind of all these packs into seven different videos so that they're not too overly long it's a lot of packs to get through i have 60 of 61 total packs uh from 1990 91 all the way up through 2021 extended uh series release the breakdown of it um it should be actually 63 packs if i had every single series but there are no series um in the 0405 series 2 there was no series that year um, again, for 04, 05 Series 2 due to the lockout. And then there was a production issue um, with 12, 13 Series 2. So no releases for those two. So you take those off. There's 61 total packs. I should have. And again, I have 60 of the 61 total packs with 03, 04 Series 1 not being included. Uh, of that, the breakdown is 53 regular hobby packs, three Canadian hobby packs for a total of 56 hobby packs. And then four of the packs, four of the remaining packs of the 60 are retail packs. I just could, could not find a hobby hobby pack of or at least it was like some outrageous price to buy a full hobby box you know like a thousand dollars or something i wasn't going to do that for one pack but that being said guys we're going to break this down like i said into seven videos and instead of doing this all in a row uh you know like seven straight days i'm going to kind of sprinkle this out because of the release date potentially again being pushed back from what i'm being told for series one of uh 21 22 but we'll see i have several of those boxes coming to me that we'll do on the channel when they come but uh, I figure, you know what, uh, enough wait, and let's just start to sprinkle this in. So I'm going to kind of sporadically be uploading these videos here over the next month or so, leading up to 2021, or I'm sorry, 21, 22 Series 1 uh, hobby box releases and stuff like that. But anyway, guys, enough of the blabbing. Sorry for that three and a half minute introduction. That will be the only one of those, I promise. We are going to get straight to the packs and all the other videos, about eight packs per video. Um, some of them might have a little bit more. None of them have less, though. Everyone has at least eight packs. And today we're going to go, they're all going to be chronological order, guys. So we're going to do 1990-91. We have the Premier Edition pack right here. This is a hobby pack. We have 90-91 uh, High Series, hobby pack. 91-92, the Low Series. That's going to be a hobby pack. 91-92, High Series, hobby pack. 92-93, uh, Low Series, that is a hobby pack. 92-93, High Series Hobby Pack, 9394 Series 1 Hobby Pack, and 9394 uh, Series 2 Hobby Pack. So all Hobby Packs here today, eight packs. Um, and I'll kind of list out players as we do all these breaks that we're looking for. I'm going to feature a couple different young guns or players that we can pull from those packs. The, the, the two guys in the background here today, Pavel Bure and Peter Bonder, young guns can actually be found in the 9091 pack. So we'll see if we get lucky with that. But that being said, guys, let's get right into this break here finally. It's been a long time coming, a lot of money into these packs, a lot of work to get these. I hope we pull some fire out of this. I have several kind of one touches at the side. I hope to be using these, at least get one or two big young guns, I hope, out of all these packs. But we'll see what we can do. Um, but yeah, and I'm sure we're going to run into some card stickage. 
Not sure which ones because I really can't tell what's in kind of each pack and stuff like that without actually opening the uh, packs for the most part. But 9091 Lose Series, let's talk. I'm not going to hit every single player. I'm not going to be able to tell you guys every single rookie you can get, but I will tell you the uh, kind of main ones that I kind of highlighted. So in low series, Yarmir Yager. These are all rookies that we're talking about, guys. Only rookies. That's what we're looking for. Yarmir Yager, Mike Madonna, Matt Sundin, Owen Nolan, Jeremy Roenick, Eddie Belfer, Alexander McGillney, Mike Richter, Kevin Stevens, Rob Brendamore. Those are going to be the big guys that we're kind of looking for. we got a star rookie of Murray Baron right off the bat. The upper decks are going to make us do the flips here in these early ones for sure. Troy Millette. We've got a nice Mark Messier. Team checklist there for the oil. Marty McSorley coming up right there. Moving on to Jody Hall. Bernie Nichols. Who have we here? Craig Fisher, star rookie. Ronnie Hextall. Nice. That's a pretty cool one there for our Pittsburgh Penguins GM. Vyacheslav Fatisov. Thomas Sandstrom. Star rookie checklist. That's interesting. I remember those being inserted in here. Uh, nice little checklist there. That's pretty cool. Star rookie checklist. Um, you got to add Balfour on that one, it looks like. Cujo. Uh, you know, a couple other decent ones and stuff like that. And our last card of this pack, Mario Maras. So, nothing huge in that one. The checklist is probably maybe the best card in that one, at least for my money. Let's do our high series 9091. Looking for. Two cards in the background there, Pavel Berry, Peter Bondra, also Sergey Fedorov, Eric Desjardins, and Scotty Niedermeyer. Those are kind of the big guys that I would highlight at least out of here. Once again, I'm not going to be able to hit on every single rookie in all these releases, so if I overlook one or two guys, please forgive me. Joe Sorella starts us on this one. John Carter, Mike Ridley, a little dinged up corner there, but that's okay. Jeff Cortnall, Jocelyn Lemieux, looks like Phil Housley. These corners are all dinged up, it looks like, in the top right. So it's going to kind of stink if we... Nice Chris Chelios uh, hit kind of a big player or something like that. I mean, that stinks that the corners are going to be dinged. Uh, Zdeno Cigar. Gary Valk. Young Guns. Our first Young Gun. Official Young Gun. Very, very nice. It's pretty cool to pull an old school Young Gun like that. Russ Courtnall. Uh, Gerald Deduck. And Denny Savard, look at that picture. Denny Savard, not the most flattering pitcher for a trading card, but uh, Denny Savard. All right, so there we go with 90-91. Moving on to 91-92, low series here. We're going to start with uh, looking for Nick Lidstrom, Timo Solani, Ziggy Palfi, Dominator, Dominic Koshif, Johnny LeClaire, Doug Waite, and Tony Monte. So some big, big players in here for sure as well, at least potential. Uh, Michael Picard. Dale Harchuk checklist. Tim Chevalde. Dean Evason, or Evason. Bruce Driver. James Patrick. Murray Craven. And these tops flips will end after, I think, today's video. Darren Shannon. Mike Peluso. Ken Sutton. Trevor Kidd, star rookie. Luke Richardson, and last but not least, this kind of little, you know, fan balloting insert thing or whatever. So, nothing crazy in that pack. 91-92 high series. Vladimir Konstantinov, Nikolai Hobby-Bullen, and Alexei Kovalev. I'd love to get an Alexei Kovalev rookie out of here. That would be pretty cool. Nice Brian Ralston. Looks like a Team USA card there in the end. Checklist card starts us off. There's JR showing up a little bit late, but that's okay. JR to the party. Uh, Dale Kushner, Steve Larmer, Canada Cup card, Joel Otto, Dave McElwain, Chris King, Jocelyn Lemieux again, Jeff Augers, Young Guns, look at that one, it's pretty cool, so we hit another Young Guns, didn't even realize that one right there, so, the Young Guns early design strikes again, but not the uh, the big players that we're looking for again, Kelly Kissio, uh, Yuha Lonen, I believe, for the juniors, and then Brian Ralston. Junior, that's actually a pretty cool one. Brian Ralston, definitely a former. Very good NHLer. All right, 92-93. We're on to another year here, 92-93 low series. Me, I am absolutely – there's actually two former great pens in this one, Marcus Naslin and Billy G, Bill Guerin. Uh, that would be awesome to pull either of those. And, again, lots of top slips looks like going to be in this one. So Gary Sutter, 
Tampa Bay Lightning, oh, Sean Chambers. That was just a weird looking back compared to the other kind of backs coming up. I thought we had something great. So Sean Chambers, uh, Brian Glenn, Valeri Kaminsky, Chris Terreri. I think that's actually, no, it's not a rookie. I thought it was, but Claude Lapointe, John Drews, Darren Shannon. Tarion Hatcher, boy, was he a absolute thorn. And I believe that's actually maybe his rookie card, but boy, was he a thorn in the side of the pens later on in his career. Dave Anderchuk, Ray Shepard, Vyacheslav Kozlov, very early in his career as well. Yannick Dupre, star rookies. Sean McEachern, former pen there, cup winner with the pens. And Dennis Vosque, or Vasque. With the uh, the juniors card there, so again nothing crazy in that one. Let's go to high series ninety two ninety three high series. Uh, Chris Pronger, Paul Correa, Saki Poison. Those are definitely the big three in here. We start with the young guns right off the bat. It's not one of the ones we're looking for, unfortunately, but it's a decent one though. It's not a bad one. Richard Smelik, definitely a former pretty good NHLer there. Nice young guns design again there. So at least we're hitting some young guns, not the exact ones that we're looking for. Uh, World Juniors, Igor Alexandrov, Peter Klima, uh, some more flips, Bobby Holik, Brian Bradley, Tommy Soderstrom, uh, Mark Freer, Evgeny Davidoff, Sean Hill, Team USA card there, Vyacheslav Kozlov again, Marty McSorley, Pat McLeod, Gary Volk, Jason Marshall, and our last card, going to be a goaltender. That's pretty cool. With Tim Chivalde for the uh, Red Wings checklist card there. So nothing too, too crazy, but another Young Guns. That's always cool. 93-94, uh, Series 1, Kimo Timonen. And for me, Sergey Gonchar Sarge. That would be pretty cool for sure to be able to pull his rookie out of here. Check out our designs here. Oh, we got our first brick, guys. Uh, ooh, listen to that. Yikes. That does not sound good. It's, oof. I hope that we don't lose too much paper loss here in this one. Uh, it's not absolutely terrible, but it's not great, though, either. I mean, obviously, you can hear there's some definitely some stickage going on there. 100-point uh, club, Mark Recchi. That's pretty cool. The Wrecking Ball. Pull that in for you guys to see that a little bit better. JR, Jeremy Roenick, 100 point club as well. Kelly Kissio, uh, team point leaders. So lots of kind of like insert subset things here. Jason Daw, uh, World Juniors. Zarley Zalapsky, another former pen. Bob Probert, Patrick Pullen, or Pauline. Uh, Thomas Yelnick. Sean Burr, Mark Tenorti, Jock Callender, and our last card is going to be Vladimir Malikov. So, again, nothing too, too crazy in there, but I'm not completely disappointed because of the paper loss that's definitely going on a little bit there. All right, Series 2, 93, 94, Series 2, our last pack of today's break, a goaltender, uh, rookie heavy pack in this one. Chris Osgood, Jocelyn Tebow, those are the big guys you're looking for in here. And, yep, another brick. Another brick, but I mean, at least it's not too, too terrible. I've definitely dealt with worse. Only seems to be a couple of cards, actually. The majority of these are not stuck in not too bad shape. All right, there we go. All right, so we got our SP insert to start us off here. So Ted Drury, this is around when they started to do the SP inserts. That's our first card. We got Jason Muzotti. I actually have his autograph rookie. Pulled that back when I was a kid. Definitely remember him from that. Dave McElwain, Brian Bellows, Dale Hirechuk, looks like Gary Suter. Uh, Aaron Gavey, looks like just World Juniors, yeah. Another World Juniors, this time of Curtis Bowen. Uh, Vito Lynch, I'm not even going to try the first name there. Fred Bath, uh, Brath, Wait. Zidane Cigar, again. And our last one, Rene Corbett, so or Corbet. 
So nothing too, too crazy in today's break, but in all honesty, guys, if I'm wanting to pull some big rookies, I'm hoping those young guns are going to be in the later or newer modern kind of packs for sure, where you can get some seriously heavy hitters. Here's our young guns we pulled, Richard Smellick, uh, Jeff Audgers, and Gary Volk. We pulled three really old school young guns today. Not the exact guys we're looking for, but it's still a really cool pull. Definitely stay tuned, guys. I have, like I said, seven more, well, not seven more, but six more videos of this coming up. Um, and the next video should be, what is it, 94, 95, all the way through 97, 98. Got those packs right here and ready to go. We got one retail mixed in there, but I think everything else is pretty much hobby. So, yeah, stay tuned for that, guys. Sorry for a longer video here. The other ones will be much shorter, I anticipate. So, uh, yeah, please do me a favor, like, subscribe, share, click that bell notification button to be notified of future videos. Well, lots more of them coming to you guys, as always, in the description below. You can find my email address, mailing address, and Instagram handle. Other than that, have a great day, a great night wherever y'all are at, and we will see you next time.